Hello everyone, this is Sheldon McDonald and I have a new update on my music player. Um, so this is my current rig, current setup. Um, your Game Master cartridge will have to be plugged into port 1. Your SD card or SD cartridge needs to be plugged into port 2 and you need it set so the boot is on two and four so the SD cartridge is technically in slot four and then the um, uh, Game Master cartridge needs to be in slot one. Okay I'm gonna turn this on. So this is some pretty cool stuff that I uh, fixed. Um, now that I've learned a little more assembly language I no longer need to refeed the uh, the music back through the cassette port like I was doing earlier. Um, now I'm actually doing it all in assembly um, and using the sound line, which I should have been in the first place, but uh, learning assembly uh, uh, takes some time. Okay, so I'm gonna load my player in. Okay, so this one is defaulting to say that the music cartridge is in slot one. So as long as your setup is the same, you have the Game Master cartridge in slot one and your SD cartridge in slot four and it's booting on slot four, then this should just automatically work and you should not have to play with any settings. Um, so I'm going to go to my folder that has all of my music. Oh, let's see, drive zero, GMC cart. Okay, so we're going to load some music in. Uh, we'll load wookie.gmc, and this one will just start playing. Okay, so this is some important stuff that I've been working on. Um, I've made it so you can now get joystick feedback. Um, the problem with calling uh, a normal joystick command. Um, well, you know what, you don't really notice it. But um, the thing is, is that if you can do it with my music player, it'll catch it right away. It'll get it faster than basic will. Um, so I have some replacement commands that take over the, the joystick ones. Um, so I'm gonna demonstrate it right now. I'm going to poke 31, no, at H7930 and one. I'm going to go 15B and 20, go to 10. Okay, so right away you're going to hear some distortion. I don't know if you can hear the distortion now. But if you look at the top corner, I've got a number. So if I got my joystick here. Okay. You can see that it's uh, writing the values to where uh, basic would normally write them at uh, 15A, B, C, and D. Uh, I didn't bother doing a second joystick, so this only uses the left joystick. As soon as I hit break, you hear the music clear up. Now, another thing I've done, edit 10. Um, so, by poking a one here, it checks both the X and Y axis. By changing this to a two, 
Oops, let me fix that. Okay, so I'm gonna put a two in there. What this is gonna do is only check the x-axis. And you can hear the music did not kick out at all. Okay, and I still got a joystick reading. Okay, as you can see. So, what does that mean? Well, let's stop the music here for a second. So what that basically means is that if you want to write a game that only uses the x-axis and a button, then it's not going to mess up the music. The music will play completely flawlessly. Um, if you poke a 2 into that value, let's see what I've done. That's what that does. So a 2 makes it so it only checks the x-axis. And by doing that, it doesn't actually have to kick the audio off. It can keep it running. And there, and by doing that, it sounds very smooth. Um, or you can poke a value of 1, and it'll get both the x and y axis. Um, and it'll only do it as you're poking it. Um, as soon as you're done, as soon as that code's read, it actually puts a, it writes a zero value to that 7930 memory location. Um, so it will not actually continuously check the X and Y axis until you tell it to. Um, so that's kind of a benefit with the, with poking it as a, as a one value. Um, you'll get X and Y, and you'll only get it when you ask for it. And that way it doesn't cut out the music as much. Um, no, this is going to be really good. Again, I've taken the cable off. This makes things so much easier. Um, how it was intended to be. Um, uh, I will be updating this shortly. I'm going to post this video first, though. Um, thanks for watching.